Please be seated. Good morning, and I want to welcome any who may be new or visiting St. Michael's Church today. It's a joy that you're here. If you are new or visiting, I invite you to fill out a card in the pew and let us know how we can get in touch with you so that we can let you know about things that are going on in this community and help you become part of this community and help us continue to become the community of faith that you need us to become. Immediately following this service, we will have our refreshments. I've seen the Warners preparing wonderful things in the community house. And um, it's, we can get there through this door at the back of the church through which you likely came in and just across the driveway. Holy Communion is offered and all baptized Christians, regardless of denomination, are welcome to receive Holy Communion in the Episcopal Church. And here at St. Michael's, simply come to the altar rail as the usher indicates that you should receive in your hand or on your tongue the host. If you wish not to receive, place your arms across your chest, receive the cup either by intinction or by drawing it to your lips by guiding the base of the chalice. Tonight, to this afternoon at 4 p.m., our own Kapellmeister Daniel is performing on the... Five. 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 Thank you. At 5 p.m. Thank you, Eratum. At 5 p.m., we'll be playing on the organ at Taft School Chapel, the Woodward Chapel, the former Christ Church. I don't know how Google will uh, names it, but look for what on earth is going on. Um, at 5 p.m., a program of German and French and English composers. If you can, join him there. It'll be wonderful. In two weeks' time, we have the last uh, of our choral evensong of, uh, of the choir year. And it's been a wonderful run. I want to thank the choir for that extra effort each month. And I also want to note, in your Anglican chant odyssey this year, today the enunciation and the way that you shaded the pronunciation was, was the best you've done all year. It was superb. Well done. Look forward. Thank you. Um, next Sunday is Pentecost. Uh, the 50th day after Easter. And although it's called Whitsunday, which is Old English for White Sunday, when baptizans would wear white after their baptism at Pentecost, it's custom to Mary to wear red, so wear red. Have some fun. Um, additionally, we're going to have a special parish meeting uh, to tidy up our bylaws just a little bit. Uh, our quorum, for example, was... Uh, the, the minimum numbers of, voted, of official voting members required to have a meeting was set at a time when we, these pews were full and we had hundreds and hundreds of members. So we have a tough time having a legal meeting, and so we're changing that. We also are bound to have a meeting on a specific Sunday of the year, which in the current climate is difficult, and so we're changing that too. If we propose that we are going to change that. So please, if you were a voting member, you will have received an email unless you unsubscribed. And, like Wittenberg of old, it's nailed to the door. And so uh, it's, it's part of our bylaws, it's custom in Connecticut to nail it to the door. And so you can go find it. Our clerk, Perry Brown, laminated it and put it on the door. If you see your name on the voting list, wonderful. If you think it should be and it isn't there, Come see me. I don't think we made any errors, but who knows? And please, we need 35 people here next week. Or on Zoom. It only takes a click. Join us by Zoom. I believe that's all we have. Except to say, what a wonderful day we had yesterday. Uh, these are from Manny and Manny King and Eason Balakumar's Kumar's wedding. And I don't think 
they're going to last till next week. So please feel free and come in and take a flower home for your mother, or if you are.